I uh, greet you all in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Um, and I thank you God uh, again for this uh, wonderful time he giving to us to be again uh, into his presence. It's me again, Pastor Isaiah Kabea. I, I was meditate in the, a lot of things what happening into our life, especially in this moment. You know, last year, 2019, um, in the month of December, 31st, all of us, we went to church. We have praising God. Because as a usual, we said, cross over to go to another steps of life. Now, the moment we went in the presence of God, we received a lot of prophecy. They said 2022 be for, for you the year of glory, the year of miracle, the year of restoration, the year of prosperity, the year of uh, possessing whatever you want. So January, all of us who were in happiness, February, all of us who were good, thanking God. March, the situation changed. And all over the world, a lot of people asking themselves a lot of questions. All of us. And in that situation, as a Christian, pastors, all of us, we were scared. All of us, we will say it. Sometimes it's the end of the end of the world. Maybe it's the end of the world. Myself, I'm speaking to you right now. I did asking those questions myself. In my heart, sometimes maybe it's the end of the world. Maybe Jesus Christ is coming. Now, we receive the prophecy. Sometimes we did receive a prophecy to say, 2020, your business to grow. 2020, you get married. 2020, you are going to have a child. 2020, you travel to go to another country. So the moment this situation happened, and the border closed, no one was moving, we end up receiving the condition to say we are not allowed to stay here, the same place over 20 people or 40 people. They give a limitation of people. Because of the situation, because of a virus. So for the one who was prepare, uh, preparing to get married, he stopped with preparation. The one who was uh, preparing to celebrate a birthday, he stopped. I said my, my, my birthday day, it was in April. I celebrated inside the house. Under meditation, read the word of the Lord. Now, in this moment, I want to speak to you to encourage you again. Your business to grow in Jesus' mighty name. Because 2020 hasn't finished. Your business to grow. The same way you receive that prophecy to say you get married, 
you'll be married in this year in Jesus' mighty name. Renew your faith. Renew again your hope and your love to say no matter what, things to be better. You will see the heaven be open in Jesus' mighty name. Before the end of this year, any prophecy you did receive from God, it will come to pass in Jesus' name. Just believe. Renew your faith. Renew your hope. Strand again in the word of God. It will be happening. You know, the Bible says, the just shall live by faith. Now, the one has got uh, hundred thousand of money is more rich to the one is got ten thousand. The one has got ten thousand is more rich from the one has got uh, one thousand. If the one has got one thousand is more rich from the one has got hundreds. The one has got hundreds is more rich from the one has got ten. If the one has got ten is more rich from the one has got is one is got one. If the one has got one is more rich. From the one is nothing. If the one is nothing, is more rich from the one he died. Because the Bible says there is a hope. There is a hope again from the one is still alive. Brothers and sisters, you're still alive. Don't lose your hope. Don't lose your faith. And the God is with you. You will see the, the goodness of God into your life. You will see. You will see it. You will see it. Sometimes before the end of this year. Before the end of this week. Before the end of the day. You will see the heaven be open. Just believe. And the strength again. In the presence of God. God bless you. Father, in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, I pray for my brothers and sisters, for those that did lose hope and the faith. Lord, you are the only one. You can renew again our hope. You can renew again our faith. You can renew again our life. Father Lord, I pray for everyone. It's faith, hope, Love be renewed again in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, dear Lord Jesus. Thank you for your miracle and the breakthrough. In Jesus' mighty name, and we pray. Amen. God bless you. Is uh, Pastor Isaiah Kabea. I love you more. And uh, please subscribe. Love you. Bye bye.